Hi guys, I'm DJ with 303 and today we're going to be talking wheels and tires and how to clean and protect them from top to bottom. Before we dive in, you're going to want to get your wheel and tire bucket prepped. If you don't have a specific wheel and tire bucket, you're going to want to do this step last so you don't introduce contaminants from your wheels to your paint. First step is selecting the right cleaner. You can try soap and water, but that usually doesn't have the cleaning power that you need to clean your wheels and tires. We have three products designed specifically for wheels and tires. You can choose what's best for you based on how detailed you want to get. First up is our wheel and tire cleaner. Just like it sounds, it works great on wheels and tires. It cleans dirt, grime, and caked on brake dust. It's got a foaming formula to let you know it's working and cleaning your wheels and removing browning on your tires. First, you're gonna rinse your wheels and tires. Then you're gonna spray the product on them and let it sit for two minutes. For tires, you wanna scrub with a hard bristled brush to remove any contaminants. For wheels, you wanna use a soft bristled brush so you don't damage or scratch your wheels. After that, you're gonna to wanna to rinse the product and let it dry. Or if you don't wanna use an all-in-one product, we have specific products for your tires and your wheels. 303 Wheel Cleaner has an iron indicating, color changing formula that shows you where it's working to remove dirt and brake dust. First, you wanna rinse the wheel and spray the product onto your wheel. Then you let it sit for two minutes. After that, you want to scrub with a soft bristled wheel cleaning brush so you don't damage or scratch your wheels. After that, rinse it off and dry. So if you're using our wheel cleaner, you're going to want to combine it with something specific like our tire and rubber cleaner. This is going to get your tires looking like new. Our 303 tire and rubber cleaner has anti-redeposition technology. This is gonna lift the dirt and debris off the surface so it doesn't get reintroduced to it. This will make cleaning a breeze. First, you're gonna to wanna to spray this on your wet tire. It will be purple at application. However, as it does cleaning, it'll turn brown. You wanna let it sit for two minutes. Then, you wanna scrub with a hard bristled brush to remove any contaminants. You wanna rinse and then reapply the product and scrub it again. The foam should be white if it's clean. Repeat cleaning may be necessary. Once it's clean, you wanna rinse the product off the surface. However you choose to get the cleaning process done, you've now prepped your tires for dressing and your wheels for protection. For our tires, we've got three choices for however you want them to look. 303 Tire Coating is an aerosol spray that leaves a satin finish. First, you want to place the can four to six inches away from the tire. Then you want to spray it evenly onto the tire and wipe any excess residue off the wheel. Then you let it sit until dry. 303 Tire Balm and Protectant is a hand applied balm that will give you a natural finish with one coat and a satin finish with two. To use 303 Tire Balm, apply it to a tire applicator or a microfiber towel. Spread evenly onto the tire and then buff with a clean microfiber towel. If you want a satin finish, repeat the process for another coat. The 303 High Gloss Tire Shine is a spray on product that will give you a high gloss look if that's what you're looking for. To use tire shine, you want to shake the product and then spray it evenly onto the tire. Then you want to wipe off any excess residue on the wheels and let it sit until dry. All three of our tire dressing products contain superior UV protection and prevent fading, cracking, and dry rot. It just depends what finish you're looking for. And we don't want to forget about those wheels. Our 303 Touch of Sealant protects most exterior surfaces, including wheels. First, you want to rinse the wheel and then spray Touch of Sealant in a crosshatch pattern on the wheel. Then, let it sit for 20 to 30 seconds and rinse off. 
That rinsing activates the SiO2 in the product and it'll protect your wheels for up to six months. That's it, your wheels and tires are clean and protected and you're ready to hit the road again. I'm DJ with 303 and thanks for watching.